first of all, I want to say thank you so many, so many of you being here today. I appreciate you coming to support the kids. They've worked hard. And Ms. Elaine and his team, they've worked real hard. Please hold your applause till the end, uh, if you would, please. And this Hard Creek Retirement Village, today you're going to have a mixture of kids and adults. Um, some of us might not look that old, but now we should, right? <laughs> but that way. But it's my great privilege right now to say that the, the Sunlight Singers are going to be coming today to the Hartford Retirement Village to sing to some of us old people. So with that said, I give you the Sunlight Singers.
All right, I'm going in now. Before I go in, I need you all to come down. Come around this way. That was a wonderful job on your first song, I'm sure. They are so excited. A Christmas party for our families and the staff? Well, Benny, that is a wonderful idea. We'll call it the first annual Hartford Retirement Village Christmas Extravaganza, and we'll do it all ourselves. By the time we get all that out, old man, Christmas will be over. <laughs> <laughs> well, how are we today? Well, we're not deaf. <laughs> Are you looking forward to Christmas? Oh yes, we've got great plans. Since this is the first year of the Hartford Village, this is going to be a new experience for all of us. <laughs> Not for me. I've been celebrating Christmases for over 80 years. <laughs> well, of course you have. Now, sit back and get comfortable. Because the boys and girls from the Christian church are here to sing for you. Isn't that nice? Oh, brother, there she goes again. Boys and girls. Come on in. <laughs> Oh, 
returned from the Nazareth in Galilee. They had the child became a strong lad and was known for his wisdom beyond the Jews. Jesus grew tall and wise and was loved by God and man. Well, I've raised seven children. 
I don't need to be acting like, treated like one. Well, I would just like to tell that Harriet Webster a thing or two. So would we. <laughs> Some folks like to think seniors just survive. We're still doing lots of things. It's great to be alive. So lift up, help me, and sometimes while you're helping, don't forget you don't have to do for us. Cause we're
That just might work. Yeah, we'll beat them at their own game, but we'll do it. Right, we'll show them who's helpless around here. I mean, I'm in better shape now than I was 20 years ago. Fit as a fiddle because of less stress. <laughs> well, let's see now. We're going to need uh, decorations. We're going to need refreshments. And we're going to need entertainment. Well, uh, we can invite our children and family, and you all can invite our parents! And Miss Webster, too? And Miss Webster, too. Well, we better, we better get started. Who wants me to help go for the tree? I'll go. Come on, you guys. There's some nice ones at the supermarket. Oh, supermarket? Who ever heard of getting a tree at the supermarket? Why, we'll just go out in the country and get one.
look, look, look how pretty. <laughs> Nothing is purple! <laughs> <laughs> wow! This actually looks nice. Oh, okay. Wait, what I meant to say was, you know, it does look nice, especially considering they were all so old. Uh, wait, wait, that's not what I meant. Even though you are old, what I really meant to say was, you know, it looks nice considering that you're all so retired from whatever it is that you did before you got so old. Let, 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 let us help you to your seat, Miss Miriam. Don't worry. We'll take care of everything. Now, does everyone know what to do and where to stay? Yes. <laughs> We'd like to welcome you to the first annual Christmas celebration at Hartford Retirement Village. We have a special program for you. Made up of residents of the village. And the Sunlight Singers. The people who walk in darkness shall see a great light. For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given. And the government shall be upon his shoulder. He shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace.
sing with us this time, huh? And now we'd like you to open your envelopes and see what's inside. Uh, we'll begin with Benny's son, Mel. That's right, that's my boy. That's my son. <laughs> Listen, mine says, will mine a lot more of my time which I should have given you years ago. Love, Pops. Dad. Dad! I promise I'm going to get you out of here. Well, for those who don't know me, I'm Lynn Bradley, Jane's mom, and I'd really like to read this one. Three months of keeping my room clean. Merry Christmas, Mom. Love, Jane. Even if it only lasts a week, that's the best Christmas present I'll ever get. <laughs> I'm Emma Gross, and I'm Patsy's friend, and this is what she has given me. All of my best recipes, which I know you've wanted for years. Merry Christmas. Oh, oh Patsy, we can bake those treasures in my kitchen. I would love to come and thank you too. <laughs> Hi, I'm John Adler, and this is my wife Susan, and we're Annie's parents. And our present says, a semester of really trying to do better in math. Love, Annie. Aww, we'll all pitch in. I know we can do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Lucy, I'm Clara's daughter, by the way, Mom, this is a terrific idea. And so, Mom has given me two nights a month watching her grandkids so Randy and I can have a couple of nights to go out. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> I 
lot of other presents to give to loved ones too. Maybe you can even think of something special to do for someone. Let's not forget though the most important gift of all. Christ Jesus. The reason for the season. When He sent His only Son to earth, He gave us the greatest gift of all. So now we would like to close our, our program by telling you that there's a gift for every adult at our doors as you leave this morning. And there's a little pin box, so if you already grab one, that's okay. But there should be one for every my all parents. Uh, and first is sixth graders in the fellowship hall after today's service. There'll be a gift there for you as well. So meet in the fellowship hall when you're done. And on behalf of uh, myself, the Hartford Retirement Community, and the Sunlight Singers, we'd like to wish you a 